Welcome back to our beachside bungalow made by Real Good Toys. Today we're showing you how to make a range from our Cricut machine using mat board as well as vinyl. Uh, first I cut it out in uh, cardstock to make sure we had the right type of model using the Cricut machine and then we went forward from that. As you'll see in this clip there it's hard to see some things but I want you to see the outline that the Cricut machine makes and when you get to the mat board, it ran through um, 10 cuttings. And then I still had to use the X-Acto knife to cut out some of them. But you can see where that's those are the handles. Um, and, and you'll see the um, dividers and the tray that goes into the um, oven range. And you can see how many passes it makes. It's just an example leaves a lot of shredded paper behind. I use my little handy little vacuum cleaner to clean up around the area in the machine. <clears throat> but it makes precise cuts and that's what makes it so nice. And it fit very nicely. Um, it is a lengthy process, but considering the mistakes I would have made by hand and possibly even cutting myself, it was well worth my time. And it allowed me while it was cutting to do other things and prepare. So this is what the range looks like um, all cut out. You can see that's the shelf that goes into the oven. I used tacky glue for pretty much all of it and I just worked on the sides trying to make sure they were all tight and uniform and then just used things to prop. And then I looked at different ideas to um, make the hinge and finally decided on this jewelry wire and what I did is I sandwiched it between two pieces of mat board, put a hole in the side of the range so that the wire would go through to give it some stability. <clears throat> so you've got some thickness inside the door. And you'll see those tiny little pieces. Those are actually plastic or silicone earring backs. I cut them in half and glued them on with tacky glue, the clear tacky glue on the outside just to protect the edge of the wire <clears throat> and it worked very nicely and then later you'll see I covered it with vinyl so that you don't even see it and then I put a, um, a little decoration around it so here we are still building the range it took me a few days imagine if I had more experience it'd be better then I needed the the glass look so I had um, a package with um, hard plastic that was clear I cut it out and then I cut a different piece of mat board so I have two layers of mat board sandwiching the plastic and um, and then like I said later you'll see that I covered it with vinyl <clears throat> not all the pictures are clear I do apologize just showing you again um, printing you can use printable vinyl with the Cricut and so I decided to make a glass top stove with the dials that are printed. So this is what it looks like when it prints off on my HP printer. And here's the silver vinyl going in the machine. <clears throat> and it just gives you an idea. It actually evaluates to make sure, and I had forgotten, I still had my uh, knife blade. I had to switch it back out to the other blade that it requires. And the machine will tell you, it's really cool. Then I decided to paint the inside of the range with a glossy black. <clears throat> Here's your vinyl all cut out, ready to peel off. I took a toothpick to the underside of one of the handles for the range and sandwiched it into the other, and then eventually covered it all with vinyl. And so you can see the process. It looks pretty messy, but once you cover it with vinyl, it works. I wanted to make it as durable as possible, so if anybody pulled on it, it wouldn't um, come off. So here are all the vinyl pieces. That's actually a silver vinyl. And that's the range top, as you can see. <clears throat> Looks real. It's really cool. And these are just the sides and the back and the top of the range with the vinyl, the black interior, and you'll see the vinyl that I put inside the, the door itself and see how well that hinge works. <clears throat> so running that wire made it nice and tight. And here you are. We have our own range coordinating with our refrigerator. So the range is made out of vinyl and mat board 
and then the refrigerator was made out of just matte board and painted with the silver. Thank you for watching. Hope you like it. If you do, please click like and subscribe, share it, tell your friends. Anyone who has a Cricut would, I think, enjoy this because um, it just shows you all the different things you can do with a Cricut. But you could also use an X-Acto knife and do the same thing. If you have any questions, let me know. Thanks again. See you in the next video. Bye.